don't let what we think is better ruffle your feathers or pins are like assholes and assholes are like podcasts. Everybody, Everybody has one. This episode is sponsored by Black Billionaire Company and Kiara Wine. From left to right, we got Straight Shot, No Chaser, Brandy Danielle in the building. We got Mr. Shoot the Fade, Big Gago in the building. We got LeBrain James, Nino Green in the building. We got Black Jesus, Arco in the building. God we got the y'all. Scrooge, O Block in the uh-huh. building. And we got Chuck in the back with the facts And last but certainly not least We got the CEO Peso Moolah in the building Moment of silence for the competition Alright one time for the queen One time (laughs) You already know Make some noise for your motherfucking boys Two times. Hello there. <laughs> 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 Hello there. <laughs> Everybody high spirited, ready to get to it. Yes, sir. Yeah. Not for real, but we Do can make it, it happen. Yeah, topics, topics, <laughs> topics, topics. And we might as well go ahead and get into what we was talking about before I did the intro, man. Where y'all at with it with this with this personally? I'm ready for this shit to be over. I'm exhausted. Mm-hmm. Oh. I'm exhausted at this point. Yeah, but absolutely. Tell me how y'all feel about where we at with the Drake Kendrick Lamar situation. O V Ho. Say O V Ho. O V Ho. This is gonna be a long Champ. summer for Drake. In what yeah, way? Man. Uh, what you mean? That's what you seen what you were just singing. Yeah. Oh man, mm-hmm. that shit has swept the country like a You saying it's gonna be a depressing summer for Drake. Long summer depressing summer. I've already Same declared shit. a winner. Damn, for real? I wouldn't I'm say all that. A winner. I, 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 think I didn't you, say I think all you, that. I think you're casting your vote a little too, too early, early man. Yeah, for sure. Too soon? I just said just off of that one record. Just a little bit. Too soon? I'm not talking about no other records that was dropped. How far are we supposed to go? Oh, it's man. over. How far are we supposed man, to take man. this? That shit make me want to crip walk. And have, I y'all ain't no seen, crip. have y'all seen the, uh, the Drake BBL action figure? Damn. <laughs> Tragic. How far are we supposed to take this? Hey, I ain't, I ain't gonna lie with all that. I ain't, I ain't ready I ain't for it to that. stop. It's a little. It's very entertaining. I'm not mad at the healthy it is competition. Very, it is yeah, very bro. Entertaining. I'm ready for people to quit. Like, like OG Fresh. I was quit man. fucking posting about this shit on Facebook. <laughs> as soon as I get on Facebook, the first thing I see is Fresh talking about Kendrick and Drake. Hey, Leave my, my nigga, let them niggas nuts go. Hey, that's bro, it's homie. six thirty in the morning. It's sitting there, yeah, that that's my say homie too. Four, he, four he, hours I got an episode ago. of Shoot the Face. <laughs> he, he, he one of the <laughs> first guests on Shoot the Face. Shout that's out to Fresh. Too. Shout out to Fresh. But bruh, wrap that shit up, gang. It was a healthy topic, though. It was. You see how you just said was? Yeah. Yeah, that was four days ago. Three, four days ago. You know how they say too much of a good thing can become bad? Like, he is Saturated. really dragging it, bro. But like, this, I bet if but, I... Cause, but I feel like that's just because it's really something there. He really don't like this nigga. He ain't the only one. Willie he Fly really be on there. But, but this is what I'm saying. Ain't nobody, ain't nobody really going as hard as Kendrick before as on the... Like, they talking about that Ross shit, but Ross, uh, Kendrick is Man, overshadowing, Ross. dude. So a person that speak on so Ross is the Arco. I was about to say this is the only nigga talking Respect, about Rick Ross. Hey, Respectfully man. so. And before we even get to that, I I love it as a lyrical competition because we don't got a lot of real rap today. Mm-hmm. So to have that and to see that, I enjoy that. Uh, and I think it, if, it, if it was to be anybody that would go against Drake on the lyrical side, though, I mean Kendrick it was, is one of the. Uh, candidates that come to mind to give him a run for his fucking money. Hey, but you know it run deeper than that. I read that uh, Kendrick had gave everybody like free rights. Mm-hmm. So any YouTube content creator, Big w. like they getting paid off that Big shit. W. Like, when, they, let me tell you why that sucks so bad. Why? Because we was playing the songs last week. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, for shit. him to catch up, and we edited it out. Oh, okay, okay. And then after Chuck then did all the work and shit, then he went on and made yeah, it to yeah, where yeah. all the content creators get react and monetize off of it. Yeah, so it's layers to it, I feel like. Shout out to K Doctor for that though. Yeah. That's yeah. how you know he for the culture. Yeah. Real he for the I ain't gonna hold you though. I, I don't never listen to the radio. I was listening to the radio, bro. They played Drake's whole seven minute joint on the radio, bro. That shit really beating. That shit push ups. Was- 
three. Nah, the, the, uh, the new one. They got three matter. different drop, switches. Uh, drop, drop and give yeah, me Yeah, then the one after uh, that. Uh, for the matter. Seven fucking minutes. Uh, uh, the heart. I've been really getting uh, trying to keep nah. it PG. Nah, the family nah, matters. Baby, okay. Yeah, but it's all matter. three in one. <laughs> yeah, the family matters. One video. when Because that's a real banger. Yeah. You know, that's the minivan from the Good Kid Mad City album cover. Petty. Love it. <laughs> if if Kendrick keep coming, well, I feel like this. If Kendrick would have been coming how he just did on Not Like Us from the beginning, I I wonder if the conversation would be different. It ain't enough material for that shit. I'm saying because you gotta okay. The reason why I say that is because think about how you was we talk about Drake, right? Drake turned his beef songs into a, into his to where you can c- continually and inf- play them out. So this is the first actual banger on Drake's level. That Kendrick has dropped during this whole fight, and look how we reacting to this shit. Mm-hmm. So if he'd have been coming, like, bringing this type of energy the whole time, I wonder if we would have. If, I wonder if it would have lasted this long. I feel like it's the bait. I felt like he dropped them other songs to bait you in. Uh, uh we're tired because you heard me. I was getting tired of the 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 nigga Manai shit. Like I was tired of it. Yeah. You feel me? And. He came with that, and that's undeniable. I ain't gonna lie to you. A banger, bro. That mo- he 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 fuck he fucking him over with Man, that. Let me say this nigga, though. Sixty nine guy. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm gonna say this though. But that lets me know where hip hop and rap is gone to because I heard a lot of people saying that he's too deep and he. I don't want to go through a dictionary to understand what he's saying. I don't. So you have mean to tell me it takes somebody like it takes a song like uh like us. Y'all got he got to dumb it down. That lets me know where y'all where y'all intellect at. But this mm-hmm. is my thing. Last week you said like today's world. These niggas. You said if you go and you go read the lyrics, I don't want to have to go read the fucking lyrics to get what you saying. Hey, some of that shit, dude. I love. Like, I mean, but dude. I don't want to have to. I don't want to have to go decipher and decode and. Facts. Half the time you are gonna have to do that anyway, cause niggas be speaking subliminal and then Metaphorically. like I don't. Yeah. I'm not following these niggas' lives like that. You know what I'm saying? To know what they sneak this about. Never, you know what I'm saying? I gotta research that. That's but why y'all I, didn't know they were sending shots to each other mm. the whole damn time way before this beef, cause but, y'all not reading or listening really year, to they've the They've been lyrics. doing this shit for years. Tell me a, another diss song where you had to decode and decipher for you to be like, oh yeah, he was talking that shit. Uh, let me see. I was about to say it was silence. So Did you, you see what I'm like, saying? Yeah. We talking about black like, before you, this beef or like period? Period in, in rap beef history. When have you ever heard a song where you had to be like, MG, MGK and yeah, Eminem. But, all right, okay. So Drake and Meek Mill. Weird. Weird. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's just straight to the point. Like, I don't want to have to, like, go decode some shit. Mm-hmm. Am I the only like, person that's standing that? What do you feel like I you mean, had to decode, Drake, though? But Drake, I'm but definitely Drake, with you on that. But Drake do that shit, though. He say shit that you have to decode. Cause that's, he what, said, that's what I'm Because in I'm his whole little beef against Kendrick, when I'm listening to this shit, I'm like, damn. I ain't even know nothing about I had to go back and research what he was talking about to even understand what the fuck he was saying. But you know why, though, right? Uh, again, <coughs> but I'm bringing up the fact that everybody's not going, you talking about straight to the point, and he's not one of them straight to the point niggas neither. Hey, I, I think that brings like, uh, more longevity to a diss when it's like, like a week or two or a month later, you go back and hear some shit like, oh, that's what he meant, rather than like a straightforward, fuck you, I fucked your bitch, this. Mm-hmm. I think... When motherfuckers really be putting like them simple little like I mean Kanye said it in the interview like niggas be dropping this is that only if you hear it you would know yeah. Jay Z that's about like you. yeah Jay Z the Jay Z yeah. the king of it so when you go back like it's like when when niggas heard Wayne real G's moving silence like lasagna I ain't catch that line I'm like a couple weeks after probably but it's like damn I want to play this song more now what else is in this shit you feel me so listen mm-hmm. <clears throat> what Jay Z do is he'll say some shit. That only you'll understand the person that he's dissing. That's not the same thing as having to decode and break down every like. Let's say me and you get into it, and you smack the shit out of me and break my glasses, right? And then you get on the diss song and you say, "Yeah, you think you got body, but your frame is weak." I'ma know, like, bro, he talking about how yeah, he broke my know. fucking. Gla- that's then, that's one thing, okay. but you get to talking about colonizing and uh, ancestors and like. Did you be like well, what I mean, that's because that's nigga? part of that nigga flow though. Like, if that <clears throat> nigga come on, if that nigga really put a record out that was just straight up like not him, like just left lane him. He gonna keep some of his demonic decoding whatever shit Kendrick be rapping about because some of that shit I pass over. Like honestly, Kendrick ain't a, a lot of that shit you top. pass over. Yeah, he's not even in my discussion. Yeah, I had like the pimp a butterfly. Like, like nigga. 
I, yeah, I don't know, bro. That Maybe I, I ain't went wanna, through enough black shit. I don't want to be depressed. <laughs> I, I, I love music. I'm gonna say I love music, and I started. Don't off, laugh at that, Chuck. <laughs> I started off doing music by starting off with poetry. So that's how I started off by doing poetry when I was a kid. On some floor tree shit. Nah. I just don't want to feel I mean, well, sad yeah, as yeah, fuck yeah. when I listen to music, you ain't bro. Know. And not to mention, though, you got to think, though, we talking we about a, be all right. Kendrick, they have, they be you Kendrick is a whole, he's a conscious rapper. He's not even your, like, from the hood, I'm going to say I sell dope bang bang in the club type of rapper yeah. any fucking way. That, exactly. But that's cool. He's a, he's a, he's a, he's a, he's a, uh, a, 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 a better common. That's real hip hop. Or that's most what I'm saying. type yeah, of shit. Talk. So you, you, that's real hip hop. You, you can't, like, it's I mean, hip hop, but two different Categories. Yeah. I think what he's saying. So you're not. He's not gonna never come like the your uh, your average uh, artist. Mm -hmm. He's coming from something mm -hmm. totally different. Right. Look, if I can't understand it, I ain't gonna like it. You know, you a beast when you got <laughs> when you got uh, professors from big <laughs> universities trying to dissect your lyrics. They have it as a course. Like, no, man, that's black excellence. Shout out to UK. Uh, man, yeah, you true. keep my man. You keep my man. I open. respect I love it, it from an intelligent. But in bat, like, do that shit with your regular shit. Like, when it's time to get busy, I want to hear you. But that's what I'm saying. He got busy, but uh, you think he can really just not keep away his regular shit from, like, getting... You, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, is that K-Dot right coming now. in? Right. Yeah. Yeah. He about to whoop your it ass. Actually, <laughs> it actually is. In the big steppers. He whooping feet. Whooping feet. But, yeah. Uh, Size seven. Show her we pie. Tell her we're potting. I'm sorry. Go ahead. What were we saying? Oh, uh, you was the one saying it. Oh, uh, <laughs> K dot. K dot. Doorbell. Now I was just like I said. I mean, I love for my brain to be picked. So going mm -hmm. back and looking up, you know, the lyrics to uh, Euphoria. That's that disc right there. That's a masterpiece. I'm sorry. Classic. It's a classic. Mm -hmm. it's, it's up there with. Well, it hit him up, all of that. It's up there. Takeover, Ether, Sheether. Hold on, wait, 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 wait. You said what's like what what's Euph on that caliber? Euphoria. 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 It's going Bruh. down as one of it's a classic. <laughs> you don't think that was a classic? Euphoria is a banger for sure. I think it was right. good. This man broke this man down from everything. How you a culture vulture, how you out here trolling, ain't you tired? This is the same man that was talking about me having Twitter fingers turn to trigger fingers and you on Instagram tweeting memes and stuff. How you gonna tell me, drop, drop, drop? You you trying to big me 